Okay, so my dad is part of a huge Catholic family. And when I was eight years old, um, I came home one Saturday afternoon and there was a young man uh, in my house who was uh, really upset and he was being consoled by my dad. And I was really struck by this image because not only had I never seen this guy before, I'd never seen a man cry. It turns out this man was my cousin. And the reason he was so upset was because he had a ticket to watch Liverpool at Hillsborough. He gave that ticket to his friend and his friend never came home. As I can't assume my audience has any knowledge of the Hillsborough stage and disaster, I intend to open the story with a flash forward to the film's ending where we see Liam uh, return home uh, but bloody nosed from a game of football which has got out of control uh, to find that his dad has been crying and his mum is white with shock and anxious to embrace him. Uh, the film will then jump back to the beginning of that day and like any Saturday morning, uh, Liam makes breakfast, he makes a mess of the kitchen and watches Saturday morning cartoons. Uh, later that day, Liam's older brother Mark is picked up by his friends and driven to the match in Sheffield. And then cutting between Liam playing football with his friends, his dad in his local pub and his mum at home, each scene will symbolically connect with the documented events taking place at Hillsborough. The film will climax when Liam is accidentally struck in the face and he finds himself in a situation which will physically parallel the crush his brother is experiencing in the stadium. We then return to the scene at the opening of the film uh, where we see Liam pass his father and we understand his dad is on his way to Sheffield and he sees his mother watching the disaster unfold on TV uh, which is when Liam realises that his brother is at the game. 